Hey y'all, it's your girl, Ari Marie. I'm just going to get started right away with priming my eyes. With my Revlon Color Stay Concealer. In the shade Light. Then I'm going to blend that out. Then I'm going to go in with my Sweet Peach Palette by Too Faced. And go in with the shade Puree. And use that as my transition shade right in my crease. Applying it in Windshield Wiper Motions. Then I'm going to go in with the shade Charmed, I'm sure. And apply that right below my transition shade, still in my crease. Then I'm going to go in with the shade Luxurious and put that all over my lid. And then I'm just going to use my fingers to blend out the edges. Then I'm going to take my color correcting primer from Milani. This gets rid of any redness in my cheeks. And from any pimples. I'm just going to evenly distribute that all over my face. Next, I'm going in with my Milani Conceal and Perfect Foundation. And I'm going to take my foundation brush with an indent in the inside and put a little bit in there. and work my way blending it throughout my face. Make sure to blend down to your neck to avoid any harsh lines. And then I'm just going to go with my beauty blender to make sure everything is nice and blended. Then I'm going to go in with my concealer and put it under my under eyes, my forehead, down my nose, my cupid's bow, and my chin. 
for highlight. And this concealer is Revlon Color Stay. Then I'm going to go in with my foundation brush and evenly blend the product so we have seamless lines. Then I'm going back in with my beauty blender just to make sure everything is smooth. Then I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contouring Palette. And taking the medium dark shade. With my foundation brush. I'm also going to add a little oil to help me blend it out. Then I'm just going to put it right under my cheekbones. my forehead and on my jawline for a more defined jaw then I'm going to take a smaller brush to contour my nose and my under lip Then I'm going to take my flat brush and blend it. With contour, you really don't want harsh lines, so you should make sure you blend it thoroughly. Next, I'm going to set my concealer with Ben Nye's Banana Powder. And I'm going to use a beauty sponge to apply that. Then I'm going to let that bake while I do my bronzer. 
And I'm going to take a flathead brush and work that over my contour. Then I'm going to go in with a fluffy brush and brush away all the excess powder. Then I'm going to spray Milani's Make It Last and spray it on my beauty blender just and tap where I had all that excess powder just to be sure any white harshness is gone. Then I'm going to take in my Revlon Insta blush stick and put that right over my contour and blend it out with a beauty blender. Then I'm going to take Milani's highlighter. And a wide brush and apply it on my cheekbones I love highlighter I always put so much on I love this Milani highlighter it's so pigmented and bright then I'm gonna put that on my nose and my Cupid's bow. Then I'm going to take Milani's lipstick in the shade Bahama Beige. And apply that over my lips. Then I'm going to take a spoolie and brush out my eyelashes. And take my eyelash curler and curl both of my top lashes. I won't be using falsies today because I'm trying to keep this look simple and easy to do. Then I'm going to go in with my LA Colors Mascara. And apply a coat to each of my eyes. And on my bottom lashes for both eyes. <laughs> I 
Then I'm going to go back in with my Milani highlighter and put it on my inner corners of my eyes. Lastly, I'm going to use Milani's Make It Last Setting Spray and spray my whole face. And this is the finished look. I hope you like it. Bye.